I warned them as we were beginning to talk to the nail banners of the day. Uh, you must have still been a baby, probably you are not even born yet. But <laughs> we quarreled with uh, uh, Matiba even about the negotiations, right at the negotiation table. I was the one who felt that uh, we had over-negotiated. In the process, we lost it. And uh, I warned at the time that we over-negotiated and the uh, truth was we may have lost the land again in the process. Our struggle was a struggle for land. It was all about the return of the land to the owners of the land. Not the silly notion of driving the white man to the sea. The notion of fighting back to get back our land. And the problem at the time, which I foresaw, and we disagreed uh, with Matiba over it, you say, yes, you say, let us negotiate. In the process of negotiation, we say the land belongs to all who live in it. The doors of lending shall be open. Now, how were we going to buy the land back from those who had stolen it? Because uh, we, were, we were not going to uh, seize the land back without compensation there would have been grave consequences if we had done that. The bloodbath would still be continuing to this day. Uh, I believed that perhaps uh, something went wrong when we were negotiating, when we over-negotiated, and we could have probably reached other decisions other than the willing seller, willing buyer. What were we, what were we going to buy the land with? Because in order for us to buy the land back, you have to raise the, uh, the GDP. The, you have to build your country to an extent that every, the equality of, 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 of our people is not a myth. That you bring up the lives of our people at par with those uh, who have owned capital. And the captains of industry ought to have been part and parcel of the agreement at Quadesa that they were going to create jobs. Governments do not create jobs. It is uh, captains of industry who create jobs. But it was not to be, we were rushing, we wanted uh, to raise the uh, flag of freedom and uh, we accommodated minorities in the process, and I warned uh, Matiba, I said, it's not going to work. We have fought with these people at grassroots level. We know them. We know them better than the leadership that was incarcerated for years on Robin Island. We understood them better. And it was the children of 1976 who turned the tide of history around, who, who said, enough is enough. You're not going to teach us history of our land in Africans. We are done. Then we embarked on the armed struggle. But then when we went to Cortesa, we had already disbanded the military wing of the ANC. So therefore we ought to have looked at the types of agreements that were not going to sell the country back to the owners of the means of production. It's a very long discussion and I don't think that's what you came for.